Welcome back to another episode on Behold Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look at what is truly possible with a surprise demo for the Xbox Series X and S and the PlayStation 5 with the Unreal Engine 5. I was very surprised to see the demo itself was based on futuristic sci-fi fantasy action adventure, The Matrix. Labeled officially as The Matrix Awakens, this demo proves what can be done today if developers were to take advantage of the Unreal 5 engine with all its tools that are set to go today. This is a free download right before the next Matrix film, but to also advertise the Unreal Engine is my guess. Closer and closer we get to photorealistic visuals in gaming that will have the player immersed within their own reality but not knowing the difference. I found it fun to deal with, especially with The Matrix. This fantasy living is also the main point. Once you see the quality of what is it presented in front of you, the immersion that can be done, and why we again are waiting to cross paths into the now current gen instead of keeping up with the last gen in our one to two year transition. I truly understand that seeing the performance of the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 with their base units sold, it's very hard to leave that business model behind, but this is something special we can't ignore. Spending upwards to $500 plus for each console, we need to know that it was worth it. This demo alone proves what you're in for for the future, yet no one is really pushing this in development. I know this video is more of a rant than ever than before, but it's hard to express what this demo is and this is not a game, but a really just a tech demo. And of course, once you're done with this demo, you get quite bored again, hoping developers answer this challenge to the gaming industry. The Matrix Awakens was developed by Epic Games and was released to the Xbox Series X and S and also the PlayStation 5 in 2021 for players everywhere to download for free. As it insists, it is a demo and there are choppiness and frame rate drops throughout, but the main intent is strictly to show off the tech. I myself downloaded the Xbox Series X as I'm running out of room on my PlayStation 5 and need the extra space. From what I hear, they are identical, so no real loss there. I'm incredibly happy they released a demo for home for gamers to experience firsthand and to know that their machine can do the impossible instead of being duped at E3 on stage or a streaming from a supercomputer. Although no real gameplay to speak of, except for the car chase, the demo screams wow in every corner of the game. Besides the car chase, you'll get to explore the city by running, driving, as if you were in your own open world. Of course, not much else to do, but once you crash into cars for the millionth time, like myself, it's a little bit fun nonetheless, but it stops very quickly. You will love the fact that this demo is working on the next gen console of choice, but will tire of it quickly as it is more of a jump start to the next gen revolution of games to come. With this new demo, it's hard not to think that developers don't have the power to make better games and performance with the Unreal Engine 5, and that's probably what it was meant to do. That's it for this look at this tech demo featuring The Matrix. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and great. Take us out of here, and I will see you all next upload.